I was struggling to figure out who took this picture. And I'll tell you why before I show you the picture. It's probably in the thumbnail. This picture is important that I have in my hand. It's not just because I took the picture or the picture was taken. No, I didn't take the picture. It's because of who's in the picture and the relationship that they have to me or that they had to me. You know, somebody that I definitely hold dear to my heart. It was my grandmother. And six years ago today was the funeral of her, of her death. I know my mother doesn't like to talk about it, you know. And this is not to try to do the memorial and the commemorative thing, but it's important, I think, to remember people and what they meant to your life and what what she meant to me was was definitely was definitely very very special. So in this moment, I'm not really here to talk about her death, even though you know we love her, we miss her, you know we still wish she was here it's it's a whole host of things that i don't really want to go and rehash today you know we just try to honor her memory and i thought this picture would be a good way of doing it to talk about the picture you know since i'm saying so much about it i might as well show you what i'm talking about. this is a picture of me when i was younger and that's my grandmother right there on the left hand side as you can see if my hand is not you know too much out the way and what I used to do when I was working up the block from her is I would just come see her and check her out and just, you know, just try to, you know, give her some, you know, some some words, some time and she would drop wisdom on me and we would definitely, you know, interact with each other. And it was just a it was just a good time. She always embraced me. She always, you know, accepted me for who I was, you know, never judged me, never looked down on me, you know always gave me these big bear hugs and stuff like that so I, I just wanted to take a, a you know time on a day like this to remember her you know for the good times and and even though this picture is not the greatest picture with the highest quality or highest resolutions it reminds me of a simpler time when I would just go see a loved one somebody who embraced me and, and loved me for me you know I, I didn't have to be anything or, or bring anything or, or purport myself to be more than I was. I was accepted, you know, it's like it's like a, a, a Tupac quote from Saw. You know, you, you love me no matter who I was. You still came with that unconditional love. You know, in the words of the late great Tupac. And it was always unconditional love. And this moment, you know, r r reminds me of that. You know, just, it's, it's real. You know, it's real. It reminds me of a simple time, you know. So, for anybody watching, for anybody seeing this, you know, anybody with any loved ones, anybody that you care about, anybody that you miss, you know, hug your loved ones that are here. Don't take folks for granted. You know, time is fleeting. I still can't believe it's been six years, you know, since uh, Mrs. Mrs. Uh, Walla passed away. You know, we love you, mommy. Um, you will be missed. And, um... I tell anybody, just just don't take your people for granted. And when you do think back on the folks that we lost, try to remember the good times. Try to remember the good times. Try to find a positive memory, something that you could share. Hopefully this finds you well. Take care. I'm just trying to focus on the good moments, like I said, because our memories is all we have. Love you. Talk to you later.